Just what will we come across this time? here again seriously just leave me alone w why must you be so obstinate just calm down it's not what you think no don't even bother you think I don't know what you're doing stop not a step closer don't be afraid I'll exercise it right now exercise it what? who are you and what are you talking about wait what Oh, he's just a person? Uh, it seems I've made a mistake. After seeing her resist so violently, I thought for sure an evil spirit was trying to harm her. Nah, it's not like that at all. She's just throwing a tantrum. Excuse me? A tantrum? <laughs> this is supposed to be a date, you know? And now that we're finally here, you don't want to go anywhere and you just want to hang around the entrance. What's the point in that? All right, fine. I was just about to walk in with you. Look, I'm sorry. I'm just a little bit scared, that's all. That's why I've been stalling. I was wrong, okay? Now that someone else is here, let's take a moment to calm down. I wasn't thinking clearly. It was pure impulse. I'm sorry. Please, forgive me. Will you give me another chance? <laughs> fine. I know I shouldn't have yelled at you. Oh, it doesn't matter anymore. You're still the best, babe. Uh, who said you could call me babe? You're so annoying. Ah, uh, so they really are on a date? But why in such a dangerous place like this? <sighs> Perhaps we should just leave them alone. Well, at least we've found some useful clues. We'll need to keep searching further in. But to avoid alerting the evil spirit, perhaps I should wait here. When we were collecting clues just now, we were still unsure whether any evil spirit is actually here or not. But now that possibility seems higher, it would be wise to proceed more cautiously. Our efforts will be wasted if my yang energy scares the evil spirit away. Besides, I trust your capability and experience as an adventurer. If you come across a powerful demon, I'll get there as fast as possible. All right. Thank you. Ugh. <sighs> I'm beat. Finally, I can take a break. Ugh. I wonder if I took things a little too far. Few people seem scared out of their minds. Huh? Hey, you shouldn't be here. Ugh. Never mind. I assume you overheard me anyway. I work here pretending to be a ghost, but now's my break time, so I took off my costume. I get all hot and stuffy wearing that thing. Of course, how could there be real ghosts here? No one wants to see a real ghost, neither us nor the participants. We just come here for the atmosphere, or should I say, the chance. Everyone wants the chance to feel the thrill of excitement. When people find themselves in a scary situation, they'll say things that they'd never dare to otherwise. That's what the test of courage is all about. <sighs> okay, I should get back to work now. Hope you and... Whoever you're here with, have a fun time. You're back! How did it go? Did you see an evil spirit? Uh... 
So that's what's going on here? No evil spirits? No danger? It's all just a setup? I... I... I see. So I was wrong again. In that case, I suppose there's no reason for us to linger here any longer. Yes, that was proof of an evil spirit's presence, but we can't be sure that the spirits still exist. Actually, I would also like to investigate that further. You're right. I'll focus my mind and spirit. Perhaps it'd be more effective for us to split up. Evil spirits will keep their distance if they sense the power of my pure Yang spirit. So you'll be more likely to find one if you're on your own. Yes, that would be best. Just keep it distracted till I arrive. I'll take this side, you take the other side. Let's move. away, but you have to ask the exorcist to let me go, okay? Uh, of course! Chen Chen never lies. So, um, what do you say? Um, uh, okay. So, I'll take that as a yes? I hope the exorcist with blue hair is a good person. Um... So, I'll help him, and you'll go talk to him. Hopefully then he'll leave me alone. Sound good? Hey, you've been turning the whole place upside down looking for evil spirits. Other participants are starting to complain. Yeah, why would an exorcist show up at the test of courage and tell everyone that there are no ghosts here? You're just stirring up trouble. Honestly, I find this whole thing quite confusing. If there really are ghosts here, then you're using them to make Mora regardless of the participant's safety. You tell me, is that ethical business practice? And if there are no ghosts here, then your so-called test of courage is nothing but a big scam. Not only are you avoiding my questions, but now you accuse me of causing trouble? I've already told you! This is what kind of event the test of courage is. It's not our problem that you're taking it so seriously. And now that you're disturbing our participants, we'll have to ask you to leave. If anything about this made any sense at all, I would leave of my own volition. But if I leave now, I'm leaving evil spirits to their own devices. Help! Ghost! There's a ghost! Run for your life! What? 
What's going on? Everyone's starting to panic. I is there really a ghost? Uh, don't be silly. But if everyone starts running, someone could get hurt. Everyone, just calm down. No need to panic. Please move in an orderly fashion. I see. So there's no evil spirits here, just a wandering ghost. And she scared everyone away because I was in trouble? If things are as you say, then she doesn't seem like a malignant spirit. Hmm. <sighs> All right. As long as she promises not to harm anyone, then I'll pretend that I never knew about her. However, if she ever does harm anyone, it'll be my job as an exorcist to come and purge her, to mend my mistake. No. No, no. This is my call. I shall take full responsibility. Mm. We should go now. It doesn't seem we're particularly welcome here anyway. What's wrong? I have faith in my judgment of good and evil. But if I begin to neglect my perception of good and evil, it may lead to something I'd regret for the rest of my days. Wait, you mean you didn't think I could be fair and reasonable? Really? Do I look so obstinate? Yeah, you're right. All right, we should leave now. Uh, okay.